This is my thousand watt. HBS thousand watt, 48 volt electric hub motor, 26 inch rim. All the other way, nice spokes. Cheap ladies bike. Come from the metal recyclers. Front sprung suspension. Twist throttle with indicator gauge and on off button. Battery pack that's just tied on there for now. now. I've done a fair bit of riding on this today. We've got 5.4 amp hours out of the pack already. Um, now I remember seeing that at about 3.8 amp, and then again at 1500 milliamp, and then again at about 3 amp as well. So we're probably more like 12 or 13 amps out of the pack so far. Yeah. Total amp hours, total watt hours. The problem is this has reset itself a couple of times. So volts minimum is 47, watts peak 1527. So most of its peaks 1527 watts. It's a lot considering it's meant to be a thousand. But well, I'm not arguing. It sounds great. Now uh, most speed controllers tucked away in there, nice and snug. As you can see, I don't need. The pedal part of this bike, I haven't even used it. Now, uh, seriously considering, even though it's a front hub motor, seriously considering slipping it in the back forks now and uh, just having it as an all electric bike because, uh, as I'll show you in a sec, traction issues are a big problem. Just set the tripod up. I'll take it for a ride around the yard. Just to show you the kind of acceleration you get out of one of these kits. Now this is very cheap. Bought it on eBay. Built my own 18650 battery. You can see the individual packs there. Give it a quick squirt on the concrete to show you. Sorry, just get the tripod right. So you don't fall over on me. Just give it a quick squirt on the concrete in front of us. see very torquey it's only just dipping below full battery and it's light now I've done probably six or eight kilometers on it today um, probably about eight of testing kind of thing so it's been given a fairly hard time If you get a tripod, it's easier to extend it. Yeah, the bag, battery bag's falling over on us, of course, but uh, I'm going to actually mount a toolbox here. We've got a couple of brackets up, mount a toolbox over the back wheel um, to 
carry the battery. Motor speed control, I can go back up in the frame then, further up, closer to the uh, motor, and yeah, this is the basic completion of the uh, first draft of the cheap ladies bike um, version of the e-bike uh, as you probably might have seen in my other videos it broke my trek 3500 which is like a $600 Australian bike um, so I went and got one with steel forks because it blew that out of there now that mode is still lucky to be 30 degrees uh, the only thing I have found that gets warm is the wire to the motor, but it cools down very quick. So, sustained hill climbing or whatever, it'll only become an issue then. Yeah. So, uh, if anyone's thinking about getting a 1000 watt hub motor off eBay, this one will pull up to 1500 watts in operation. So, uh, that's about 30 amps. Um, at 48 volts, I'm running um, 52 volts theoretically. Uh, I've got an extra pack, the white one's the extra one in there so far. And uh, yeah, we started off at 55 volts this morning. We used nearly 200, well, over 200 watt hours already, 31 amps at peak. Yeah, it's the 18650 packs are holding up beautifully. My dog's still a bit wary of it. Anyway, thanks for watching and uh, we'll make this a bit better and add a uh, carrying rack to the back of it for the batteries. May even make the pack a bit bigger. We'll see what happens. Thanks for watching. I'll uh, keep you updated on my electric bike projects.